，请你们站起来。Okay, good. All right, good. Okay, praise the Lord. Let's bow our heads for a prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you for all of your blessings to us. Ten fu wei la ni suo zhi gei wo men de jiu an yes of zhu gei wo men de jiu fu wo men gan xie ni. We are especially thankful today for all of these mothers that are here. Wo men te bie xue wei la jin tian lai de jie xie mu qian men. We pray that today they will feel your love. Wo men pan wang jin tian ta men hui gan jiao gan jiao dao ni de ai. We also pray that they will feel our love. Father, we know that they pay a great price to be mothers. They live a life that uh, they do without for their children, for their families. And Lord, we know that they have big hearts. Their love is great. And Lord, too few times do we tell them that we really love them. But today, Lord, help them to feel it. Feel your love. Feel our love. We ask that you bless the sermon today to speak to every heart. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In Ephesians chapter number 6, verses 1 to 3, the Bible says, Children, obey your parents. Okay, let me start that again. Children, obey your parents in the Lord, for this is right. Verse 1. In Ephesians chapter number 6, verse 1 to 3, that it may be well with thee, and with thy, thou and thou mayest live long on the earth. This promise was given by God, that if we would obey our parents, that it would prolong our life. This is a commandment, in fact, it's the fifth of the Ten Commandments. Today we are going to look at five mothers from the Bible. All of them have their own specialties and they all have their own uh, good points and bad points. There are many women mentioned in the Bible. Some of them are good women. They 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 do wonderful things and they pay great prices to uh, to help their families. Others, they're not so good. Uh, 圣经里面记载的母亲有一些是非常高贵的，他们为着自己所爱的人民以及家人付出高昂的代价。另外也有记载一些不好的。The five that we're going to look at today represent those that uh, do the good towards their family. 我们今天所看的五个母位的母亲是属于。the first mother that we want to uh, see today is Eve, the first mother. I guess it's probably fitting we start with the first mother because that's where it all started. In Genesis chapter 3, verse 20, the Bible says, And Adam called his wife's name Eve, because she was the mother of all living. 
第呃《创世纪》第三章二十节，亚当给他妻子起名叫夏娃，因为她是众生之母。She was the first wife, but she wasn't a mother yet. But in chapter four of Genesis verses one and two, it says this: And Adam knew Eve, his wife, and she conceived and bare Cain, and said, "I have gotten a man from the Lord." And she again bare his bare his son, his brother Abel. And Abel was a keeper of sheep, but Cain was a tiller of the ground. 在这里，在第三章的二十节，夏娃呃，只是一位妻子。然后他成了母亲，在创世纪的四章一到二节，有一日，那人和他妻子夏娃同房，夏娃就怀孕，生了该隐，便说：“耶和华使我得了一个男子。”又生了该隐的兄弟亚伯，亚伯是牧羊的，该隐是种地的。Being the first woman, everything was starting with her, so she's got a lot of firsts. 呃，作为第一个。女人，或者说第一位母亲，她身上有很多个第一。Eve was the first woman and the first mother. 首先，夏娃是第一个女人，呃，也是第一位的母亲。She was the first ever to go through the pains of childbirth. 她是第一个经历生孩子的疼痛的人。Those of you that have given birth know what she went through. 你们当中有生过孩子的，你知道那经历的痛苦有多大 ？She was the first and only woman to bear the title "Mother of All Living." 她也是第一位，也是唯一的一位有一个名称叫做“众生之母”。She was the first mother to have an angry, rebellious child. 她也是第一位有一个非常。愤怒悖逆的孩子的母亲。Some of you know what we're ta- what I'm talking about. 你你们那当中有人可能知道我在说什么。She was the first mother to experience、uh, the loss of her child in death. 她也是第一位经历孩子呃失去孩子痛苦的母亲。She was the first mother to experience a child leaving home. 她也是第一位母亲的经历孩子离开家这个过程的母亲。You have your children until they just、uh, just graduate from high school, usually, and some of them decide they're going to go to school far, far away. 呃，你你们家里有孩子的的，当他长大了之后，有一些孩子他决定要去远方求学，呃，等等，他们离开家。And when they leave, there's a there's some feelings、uh, that they leave behind with their mother and father. 当他们离开家，呃，到远方去做事、求学的时候，啊，呃，他，呃，他的离开，让在家里的爸爸和妈妈，呃，感受到一些很特殊的呃经历和情感。They will walk past that empty room every night and say, "I wonder how." My son or my daughter is doing. They 每天晚上在那个空房间门口路过的时候，他们都禁不住在想，我那个去了远方的儿女，他现在正在做什么呢 ？They wait eagerly for that day when、uh, school is out or when、uh, university is out or when there's a special holiday they can come home. 他们呃，这些父母都在等待说。呃，放假的日子，学校不用，大学不用上课的日子，他们的孩子可以回家。Eve was also, she Eve was not only the first mother, she was the first grandmother. 当然，夏娃不单单只是第一位的母亲，她也是第一位的祖母。This is told to us in Genesis chapter four, verses twenty-five and twenty-six, tells us that her son. Gave forth birth, and now she's a grandmother. 在呃那个创世纪的第四章，我们看到他们的呃亚当和夏娃的孩子开始有了孩子，那他就成为很自然的就成为祖母了。I think becoming a grandfather, grandmother is 
better than being a father mother. Uh, but you have to do the first before you get the second. So I, I think our, our children train us how to be good and then our grandchildren get to enjoy the, the blessing of it. Eve, all gene genealogy trees go back to her. We can see that all the trees go no matter whether you were born in the west or the east or the north or the south or whatever country or uh, ethnic group you're from, all of us on the face of the earth, we face tra trace our genealogy part back enough, we get to the beginning and we find Adam and Eve. The Eve surely was a mother of first. Our second mother is Sarah, the elderly mother. The first time she is mentioned in the Bible, it simply says that uh, she is the wife of Abram, or Abraham as his name becomes later. Uh, the verse immediately following that verse tells us that she was barren. She had no child. In Genesis chapter 16, uh, the story of Sarah's uh, failed attempt uh, to produce an heir for Abraham, uh, that's where it's found. She wanted to fulfill God's promise, so she tried to help God by giving her her maid uh, to be a second wife to her husband. Uh, but all that was really accomplished by that was the start of the age-old Arab-Israeli conflict. Second wives really don't work very well. The, the, yeah. It just calls family problems. And then the family problems became regional problems. And these regional problems became national problems and rural problems like today. Finally, when Abraham was a hundred years old and Sarah was ninety, God was ready to fulfill his promise to Abraham. Uh, 
Genesis chapter number 21, verse 1 and 2 say this, And the Lord visited Sarah as he had t said, and the Lord, said, Lord did unto Sarah as he had spoken. For Sarah conceived and bare Abraham a son in his old age at the set time of which God had spoken to him. Yeah. 便照他所说的给撒拉成就。当亚伯拉罕年老的时候，撒拉怀了孕，到神所说的日期，就给亚伯拉罕生了一个儿子。In the New Testament book of Hebrews, chapter eleven, we have a list of people of faith. 在希伯来书第十一章，我们有一个信心英雄榜。in verse 11 of chapter 11 Hebrews, it says, Through faith also Sarah herself received strength to conceive seed and was delivered of a child when she was past age because she judged him faithful who had promised. <coughs>希伯来书十一章十一节因着信连撒拉自己虽然过了生育的岁数 <coughs> 也还能怀孕，因他以为那应许他的是可信的。Ninety year old becoming a mother. 他在九十岁的时候成为妈妈。We can't understand all that was happening, but that's what happened. 我们虽然不知道当时的详细情况是怎样，这的确是发生在萨拉身上的事。When the angel of the Lord came and told Abraham, "It's time. Uh, I'm going to fulfill God's fulfilling His promise." Abraham, he just said, oh, he, "He just kind of laughed. I think he was just kind of he couldn't take it. It was so much. He said, 'How could you know?'" When I'm 100 years old, you're going to do this. When my wife's 90 years old, you're going to do this. 当上帝应许亚伯拉罕的时候，亚伯拉罕是不敢相信的。我都是一百了，我的妻子都九十了，还能生育吗？ Genesis 17:17 17, 17 says this. Then Abraham fell upon his face and laughed and said in his heart, "Shall a child be born unto him that is a hundred years old?" And shall Sarah that is ninety years old bear? 创世纪十七章十七节，亚伯拉罕就伏伏在地喜笑，心里说一百岁的人还能得孩子吗？萨拉已经九十岁了，还能生养吗？ Both Abraham and Sarah had lapses of faith, like we all do, but God proved His faithfulness. Uh, <coughs> 亚伯拉罕和萨拉都有信心软弱的时候，但是上帝显明他自己是信实的、守信的人。What he promises, he will deliver when it's his time. 他所应许的必定成就，在他的时间表里面。At the age of 90, Sarah fulfilled her greatest ambition of being a mother. Our third mother today is Jacobed. Uh, she is the mother, the courageous mother. In Numbers chapter 26, verse 59, it says, And the, sa and the name of Amram's wife was Jacobed, the daughter of Levi. <coughs> whom her mother bare to Levi in Egypt. And she bare unto Amram, Aaron, and Moses, and Miriam their sister. In Numbers 26:29, at the time of Moses' birth, 
the Egyptian pharaoh uh, made a decree that all newborn male babies, uh, Jewish babies, uh, were to be thrown into the Nile and drowned. 凡是以色列的男婴生下来的时候 要扔在尼罗河里面 He was afraid that the population of the Jewish people was growing so fast that they would someday have an army bigger than his and so he wanted to get rid of all the males uh, from that generation 埃及的法老生怕以色列人生养众多，他们的人口有一天超过埃及人的时候，会造成他们统治上的困难，所以他要把所有生下来的男婴给杀死。Though <coughs> she knew what the government required, what the pharaoh required. She could not obey. So, so you the this Jason Po do follow the Yao Chu may ban fa chu ying da ying. There comes a time when the government says something that is against God's word. We must choose to walk with God. Dang the woman the Jung Fu. 呃，说了一些或者做一些跟上帝的旨意是相违背的的那样的时候，我们就要面临一个选择，选择听呃的政府的，还是选择听上帝的。So when Jacobed gave birth to Moses, she decided I will hide him and keep them from finding him. 当约基别生了一个男婴的时候, 他就要决定, 这个男孩是要听话的, 交给政府, 按照政府的方法处理, 把他处死, 还是藏起来, when it became impossible to hide baby Moses any longer, she made a small boat of bulrushes and placed it along the reeds at the side of the river. 当这个孩子渐渐长大，长大到不能再长的时候，他就做了一个蒲草箱，把这个婴儿放在箱子里面，就放在尼罗河上。She had done all she could do to preserve the life of her baby Moses. 这，他尽了一切的他能做的力量。来保存这个孩子的性命, so at that time she put her baby's future in God's hands. 最后她把自己的孩子的未来交在上帝的手中. And by the grace of God, baby Moses was discovered by a princess of Egypt. 这印着上帝的怜悯, 这个婴儿摩西, when we think there isn't a way, God always has a way. Exodus chapter 2 verses 6 to 9 tells us this. Verse 6 says, And when she had opened it, opened the, the, uh, the little boat there, she saw the child, and behold, the baby wept, and she had compassion on him and said, This is one of the Hebrew children. Do you ever wonder why the baby cried right then? 有没有想过为什么孩子在那一个时刻哭了呢? I can't prove it from scripture, but maybe when the angel just kind of pinched him right there and said, it's time for you to cry, you, this, this woman needs to hear you cry. <laughs> uh, 我不能证明啊,但是我猜当时天使在那孩子的旁边捏一捏他说,喂,是时候你哭了。there's something about ladies, especially mothers, when they hear a child cry, it just gets right to their heart. 
，一个女生，特别是妈妈，听到孩子的哭声的时候，这这这这哭声能够对他们的心做出一些非常奇妙的事情。Mothers seem to know it's their child. Ch children they cry the same, you know, they make the same sounds, but mothers know which one is their child when they cry. 呃，在呃一个地方有很多孩子。但是哪一个孩子哭的时候呢？他的妈妈总会知道是自己的孩子。所有孩子的哭声都好像听起来差不多的，但是妈妈能够分辨得出哪一个哭声是自己孩子的哭声。Jacobed had sent Miriam, Moses's older sister. To keep a watch on the on on the baby and see what happened. 这个摩西的呃姐姐米利安呃是远远的跟着，要知道这个孩子会怎样。Verse number seven says, "Then said his sister, that's Miriam, to Pharaoh's daughter, 'Shall I go and call for thee a nurse of the Hebrew women that she may nurse the child for thee?'" 孩子的姐姐。就是玛丽玛玛米利安对法老的女儿说：“我去在希伯来妇人中叫一个奶妈来为你奶这孩子，可以不可以 ？”Verse eight says, "And Pharaoh's daughter said to her, 'Go and the maid went and called the child's mother.'" 法老的女儿说：“可以。”童女就去叫了孩子的母亲来。Jacobed didn't have to be afraid anymore because she was watching her child at the order of the princess, a princess of Egypt. The 约基别不再害怕，因为他看见自己的孩子在一个公主的手里，在埃及法老女儿的手里。So she when. Jacobed came. This is what take, took place. Verse number nine. And Pharaoh's daughter said unto her, "Take this child away and nurse it for me, and I will give thee thy wages." And the woman took the child and nursed it. Pharaoh's 女儿让米利安把约基别叫来之后，第九节，法老的女儿对他说：“你把这孩子抱去，为我奶他。”我必给你工价。妇人就抱了孩子去奶他。God worked everything out for her. 上帝使他，呃，上帝安排好所有的事情。Not only was Moses' life saved, but his mother got to to raise her own son and get paid for it. <coughs> 不单指摩西的生命得以保存，他的母亲。呃，还因为喂养自己的孩子而得到工匠。God bless this courageous mother. 上帝祝福这一位勇敢的母亲。Mothers, do what is right, and God will abundantly bless you and your family for it. 母亲们，你们要做对的事情，上帝会大大的祝福你。和你的家庭，因为你做的事。We come to the fourth mother. 我们看第四位母亲。Her name is Hannah, and she's the praying mother. 她的名字叫哈娜，呃，她是一位祷告的母亲。First Samuel chapter one, verses one to three. 撒母耳记上第一章一到三节。Verse number one says, "Now there was a certain man of the long word、uh, Ramoth Aim Zophim of Mount Ephraim, and his name was Elkanah, the son of Jehoram, Jehoram, and the、uh, the son of Elihu, the son of Tohu, the son of Zeth, Zuth, and an Ephrathite." 以法嗯，撒母耳记上第一章第一节，以法莲山地的拉玛索菲有一个以法莲人，名叫以利加拿，是苏佛的玄孙，托户的曾孙，以利户的孙子，呃，耶罗罕的儿子。God always tells the truth, whether 
the truth is according to his will or not. He lets things happen sometimes just because we make the decisions. But it says in verse number two, and he had two wives. This man had two wives. The name of the one was Hannah, and the name of the other, Penina. And Penina had children, but Hannah had no child. Children. And this man went up out of the city yearly to worship and to sacrifice unto the Lord of hosts in Shiloh. And the two sons of Eli, Hophni and Phinehas, the priests of the Lord, were there. For the first 400 years after Joshua led the people of Israel to possess the promised land, Shiloh was the resting place for the tabernacle. Those who wanted to worship the true and living God and make their sacrifices went there. One of those years, uh, Hannah prayed and made a vow to God. 在, uh, 在一次的去世罗敬拜的事的事的日子里面哈拿就在耶和华面前许愿 1 Samuel chapter 1 verse 11 says And she vowed a vow and said O Lord of hosts If thou wilt indeed look on the affliction of thine handmaid And remember me and not forget thine handmaid But wilt give unto thine handmaid a man child Then I will give him unto the Lord all the days of his life And there shall no razor come upon his head 十一节许愿说哈拿许愿说 when I was a, I guess, teenager, about 15, 16 years old, uh, it was the time in, in uh, United States history where we had a group of people called the hippies. Uh, uh, that's before some of you were born, probably, but others maybe know about it. Uh, they like they like to live free and they like to do things, and they didn't cut their hair. The fellows didn't anyway, and uh, probably the girls neither. They just let their hair grow, you know. And uh, they they use verses like this, saying, "Well, the Bible says you ought to have long hair if you want to be strong and be a man." Uh, <coughs> 不够老的见过他们这些人 this little boy was not going to grow up to be a hippie. But he wore his hair long and never cut his hair, never had it cut, because his mom, before he was born, made a vow to God that it would not happen because that was the sign that this vow had been made. This 
she made reference to not cutting his hair because that was the <coughs> one sign that showed forth what a Nazarite vow was, what she made for her son. This is a Nazarite person. It's one of the features. His mother, Hannah, the Bible says that God heard her prayer and answered her prayer. First Samuel chapter one verse twenty, wherefore it came to pass when the time was come about after Hannah had conceived, that she bare a son and called his name Samuel, saying, Because I have asked him of the Lord. 撒母耳记上一章二十节，哈拿就怀孕，日期满足，生了一个儿子，给他起名叫撒母耳，说这是我从耶和华那里求来的。She asked God to give her a son. God gave her a son. 她许愿求上帝赐她一个儿子，上帝就赐给她一个儿子。she told God, if you will do that for me, I will give this child back to you. This child will be dedicated to you for life. Let's see what happened. First Samuel chapter one, verses twenty-seven and twenty-eight. It says, For this child I prayed, and the Lord hath given me my petition which I asked of him. Therefore also I have lent him to the Lord. As long as he liveth, he shall be lent to the Lord. And he, and he worshipped the Lord there. 27节,我祈求为要得着孩子,耶和华已将我所求的赐给我了。所以,我将这孩子归于耶和华。after Samuel was weaned, Hannah took the tabernacle, and there he stayed. Every year when it was time for the family to go, she went there excited. Why? Because she was not only going to see, be, see God and worship God, she was going to be there and see her son. The Bible tells us that he grew up there and was called by God to be a prophet and gave the children of Israel spiritual leadership over many years. This great man of God was a product of a praying mother. Her name was Hannah. The fifth mother we'll look at today is Mary, the Savior's mother. 最后我们所要看的一位母亲就是玛利亚 Luke chapter 1 verses 30, and th uh, 30 to 33 says as it records the angel's announcement to the young virgin named Mary that she had been chosen by God to be the mother of the Savior 在路加福音的一章我们看见这样的记载因为天使的宣告 那我们知道这一位年轻的处女被拣选成为上帝的救主的母亲 Verse 30 says, And the angel said unto her, Fear not, Mary, for thou hast found favor with God. 
三十节说的，天使说：“不要。”天使对他说：“玛利亚，不要怕，你在神面前已经蒙恩了。” Verse thirty one, and behold, thou shalt conceive in thy womb and bring forth a son, and shalt call his name Jesus. He shall be great and shall be called the Son of the Highest, and the Lord God shall give unto him the throne of his father David. 主神要把他主大卫的位给他。And he shall reign over the house of Jacob forever, and his kingdom、uh, there shall be、uh, there shall be no end. He shall be Jacob's son forever, and his kingdom there shall be no end. In verse 38 of Luke chapter one, it says, "For with God nothing shall be impossible." Thirty-eight says, "Mary said, 'I am the servant of the Lord. I am the servant of the Lord. I am the servant of the Lord. I am the servant of the Lord.'" Mary provided Jesus with motherly love. Mary, uh, gave Jesus a mother's love. For thirty-three years of his earthly life, she was there for him. In the earth, in the Jesus, in the earth, in thirty-three years of his earthly life. Maria 都呃在他身边照顾他。She did not push him to do her will for his life. She pushed him to do God's will for his life. 这一位玛利亚从来没有呃的强迫耶稣去做他想要做的事情，他都是的让他去成就呃呃上上帝要他成就的事情。From the beginning of Jesus' ministry, at the wedding of Cana, where Jesus turned water into wine, she followed him as she fo、uh, as he followed the heavenly Father's will. 在主耶稣开始的服侍的时候，在迦南的婚宴上，耶稣使水变成酒。在那个时候，的的玛利亚也是吩咐人听从，呃。耶稣的，而不是呃呃，而听从耶稣的，也是听从啊、呃、天父的。She followed him all the way to the cross. Maria 跟随着耶稣，一直跟到十字架底下。There on the cross, Jesus dying for our sins, saw his mother, and he said to John, the beloved apostle, "Take her for your mother." Mother, take him for your son. He'll take care of you. 在十字架上，耶稣啊，快要死的时候，他看见自己的母亲，他就对自己心爱的门徒约翰说：“看哪，啊，这是你的母亲。”啊，对母亲说：“看哪，这是你的儿子。”把自己的母亲托付给了约翰。Mother, this mother Mary, she was a faithful, loving mother. Right to the end. This Mary, she is a faithful, loving mother. On this Mother's Day, what lessons can we learn from these five mothers? In today's Mother's Day, what lessons can we learn from these five mothers? From Eve, we learn that mothers are not sinless. Nor are they infallible, but they are our mothers, and we should honor them. From Eve's 身上，我们看到母亲不是呃无无瑕疵的，没有罪的，也不是不会犯错误的，只是他们是我们的母亲，我们理应按照上帝的意思呃孝敬他们。From Sarah, we learn that every child is a gift from God and needs our love and care. From Sarah's hands, we know that every child is a gift from God and needs our love and care. From Sarah's hands, we learn that every child is a gift from God and needs our love and care. From Sarah's hands, 
照呃来养育他们。From Jacobed, we learn that when we obey God, He will protect us and our children, our whole family. 从约基别身上，我们学到的是，如如果我们顺服上帝，他就会保护我们以及我们的儿女。From Hannah, we learn that we should dedicate our children to what God wants them to do. 在哈拿的身上，我们学到的是，我们应当把我们的。儿女献给谁呢？的，我们应当教导我们的儿女长大之后成为什么样的人呢 ？From Mary, we learn that nothing is impossible if we put our faith and trust in our loving, almighty God. 从玛利亚身上，我们学到的是，如果我们把我们的信心。呃，这建立在上帝身上，我们信靠的是单单是这一位满有爱、大有能力的上帝的话，没有什么事是不可能的。Mothers, God loves you. 妈妈们，上帝爱你们。And so do we. 我们也爱你们。Let us pray. 我们一同祷告。Father, we thank you today. We thank you for every person that's here, but especially for the mothers. Ten for women, gentle and gentle. Ten is the way that we like to make it. Yes, because in that night, John, just we must be all gentle and way that we can be. Some of our mothers aren't here. Can we share in the mutual butzajeli? Some are already with you. Can we share aging? Now, ten times you. But Father, whether they're with us physically or they are just in our hearts, we love them. 无论他们是站在我们的旁边，或是他们就是在我们的心，我们还是爱他们。And we're so thankful to you for loving us enough to give us our mothers. 我们也感谢你给我们我们的母亲。And Father, I pray that you would bless them. 求你祝福他们。Help us. Their sons and daughters to be what we ought to be in honor of them and of you. Bangju woman, taman da arnu. Bangju woman, zuo gai zuo na. Wei le, wo men nang go zai mei taman, ye nang go zai mei ni. Father, today I pray that you will speak to hearts through your word. Tian fu chou ni yong ni de hua yu jin tian zai wo men de xin. Maybe there's a mother here that has a need. May she come and find her rest and peace in you. 可能在这里有一个母亲，她她心里有有一些问题、一些困难，她不知道怎么办，让她今天能够来到你的面前，得到安慰，得到智慧。Maybe there's some that need to be saved. 可能有一些人需要得救。There may be some sons or daughters here that are the object of their mother's earnest prayers that they be saved. 可能在我们当中有一些儿女们，他们是。他们妈妈的迫切的祷告，他迫切的求你救了他们的儿子。Maybe there's some husbands that have that need. 可能说有一些先生有这样的需要。Whatever our need today, Lord, help us to do Your will. 无论我们有什么需要，让我们做到你完美的旨意。Those that are faithful to You, You bless. 信靠你的。忠心的，到你面前来的，这些人会得到你的祝福。We pray this in Jesus' name。我们这样祈求，奉耶稣基督的名求，阿门。